Hello everyone, Earned a Worm here, and recently I did a video where I opened up four of these Tomb Tomb Mystery Stack Packs, and I liked them so much that I went back and got four more. You can see in the back the four that I got in the previous video. I did kind of fill the bags this time to try to avoid any doubles, so I'm hoping that I got four new ones here. Let's start with this one in the front here. I really, really like these. They were made really well. Okay, our first one, we got Lucky. We really did get Lucky because it's a new one. Okay, I got Lucky out of his packaging now, and he comes with this TV, which I think is really cool. The TV on the pack actually looks really red to me, but this one's more brown. The TV has this big curve on the bottom. Looks like it would sit on top of the dog, but in the packaging actually shows him on top of it so that's the way we'll do it but it actually could go on there okay so on to number two and I did find these at Walmart and I think they're $2.88 a piece okay and our next one is Marie so I'll get it out and get it put together this one is a really cool one I'm not really sure what it's from but I know it is one of the ones I want because it just has this really cool bed Okay, so I got her bed put together. It was actually in four different pieces. It's really nice when it gets put together. And again, for the price of these, this is a really nice little toy to get this cool canopy bed and the little Marie cat. But if you know what she's from, let me know. Because I'm not sure. Okay, on to our third one. Okay, and we got the mini. Okay, and there's our mini out of the packaging, and I just realized why these have these big curved bottoms is because Tomb Tomb actually stands for Stack Stack, and these are mystery stack packs, and you're supposed to stack them all. I'll try that at the end of the video, and we'll see how well that goes. She goes in her big old bow, got a little curly tail on her butt. Okay, now on to our fourth and final one for this video. Let's see who we got. Okay, and we got Sebastian this time. So cool, we ended up with eight different Tomb Tombs. Pretty good. Like I said, I did fill the pack a little bit, trying to avoid the doubles. I'm going to get Sebastian out, and we'll have a look at him. Okay, and Sebastian comes with this big clamshell here with a little seaweed in it. And then he goes right up in the shell. That's a really cool one, too. He seems like he may be a little bit harder to stack with, though. So I'll use him last. Okay, now I'm going to try to stack some of these. I'm going to start with this one because it seems like it would have a nice sturdy base. Okay, then I'm going to go with Lucky. Put his TV on him. Okay, then I'll put Winnie the Pooh on top of the TV. <laughs> then I'll put his pot of honey on top of... Ah! But you get the point, you actually can stack them pretty good. They are made to actually stack with their accessories. So that's pretty neat, and that's something fun you can do with them. Then you could try to not make them put four. Let's put mini on there. <laughs> it's going to be hard. Nah. It's going to be hard, Daddy. This would have to be the top of your stack, because I don't think you'd be able to stack anything on top of that one very easily. So there's all the Tomb Tombs I've got in the two videos I did with them. I really like these little characters, and I, I look forward to the other series. I'm assuming since they labeled this one Series 1, they have some other series planned. But that's all I have for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to keep up with videos. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye.